Hey YouTube, I hope you're all doing well in these uh, pandemic times. Um, I'm doing this chatty video because we actually had uh, a racing event uh, yesterday in Mjolnik. Uh, it was like the third uh, racing event in the Czech Republic. So it was really nice to be able to race again in a beautiful summer day. And I did duke it out with my son that's in the picture. Uh, right here, he was actually uh, pulling uh, better qualifications than me, so he got in front of me there. But during the elimination rounds, I did manage to get past him. I may uh, or may not have eliminated him with uh, midair, but you know, such is life. <laughs> I, uh, uh, of course, I did not intend to be repairing his quads on purpose. The uh, footage you're seeing here is from the Insta360 Go, which I did put on the race quad as well. But sadly, both cases, I did have a crash and I catapulted the camera, you know, like literally 15 meters away. And it was only thanks to having 20 plus pilots search for it uh, that we found it. And I <laughs> didn't feel like putting it on. Uh, for the third time, I also caused a fire in this very dry uh, grass, but I'll talk about that later. The event itself was very chill. We did not have everybody from the scene. We did have, you know, the big names like uh, Lukáš Košata, Lukáš Lendvorský, uh, Kuba Toman, uh, Petr Horák, all those hot shots, but we did miss some like uh, Vojta Vejšický and uh, David Špaček. Uh, but it was definitely a very, very uh, competitive uh, race. Um, I selected this elimination round where I let uh, Lukáš Košata, uh, you know, uh, start uh, to get ahead at the start because I knew he, he can do like a full lap in front of me but also I didn't want to uh, do any mid airs at the beginning but then I did two mistakes and I had really uh, you know hands full with uh, Tadeáš Šroučka who I didn't even have on my radar and he really like got ahead of me and I had trouble catching up with him and then uh, unfortunately he crashed out uh, but yeah, it was a very, very fun, uh, tight race. I also have one after this one where uh, that was a semi-final um, elimination where I unfortunately um, collided uh, frontally with, uh, with Petr Horák at the power loop section. Um, <laughs> Those who remember my uh, uh, Drone Champions League uh, f flight from Paris would say that that's my si signature move to <laughs> to uh, take out somebody uh, uh, from my team. Uh <laughs> but yeah, that was that was unfortunate. But still, ended up fifth uh, overall, and I truly enjoy this beautiful day. Um, the last thing is coming. No, no there's, there's one, more, one more lap. I did, I did mess up there uh, quite a little, uh, quite a bit actually. Um, the one last thing that I'm gonna mention is the fire that I almost caused. Well, I did cause it, but we did take it off because we had extinguishers. And uh, by the time I got to my quad uh, with the that was the unfortunate hit here. Yeah. Um, so this is this is the footage from the Insta360 Go. It's slightly cropped because uh, it was corrupt, both the image and the uh, gyro data. So it would be spinning uh, if I showed you the um, uh, the stabilized. Uh, a version of, of this clip so I just uh, hit the uh, hit the uh, the structure in the middle and then 
for a split second in my FPV feed, I saw smoke. So I'm like, ah, smoke. And I went there, and by the time I got there, the whole thing was on fire. And including my battery, my props just, you know, <laughs> burned out. Um, the stack was burned out, but I did uh, manage to get out the, uh, the some of the motors and the receiver and the VTX so and the camera so the good parts Before I let you go, I'd like to invite you to an event uh, that comes in two weeks. All the info will be in the description. Um, and we did a little promo uh, video for you with a very cheesy voiceover by yours truly. But if you're around the Czech Republic, uh, it's near Pilsen, uh, you know, the place where Pilsner got its name from. And it's gonna be really spectacular because it's uh, it takes place at an old uh, ruin, like a castle ruin. So it's gonna be a very special event. Um, even if you're not competitive, it's still going to be uh, pretty rad to fly uh, at that location. And it's going to be a, a night race also. So uh, there's, there's there's good stuff to uh, look forward to. So if you're around. Please uh, look in the description to see how to uh, sign up and uh, hopefully I'll see you there. Take care guys. In today's fast paced life, it may seem like the world is tick tock slipping through your fingers for just one minute. 1 minute 45 Escape the bitter realities of everyday life Come join us in tranquility of the medieval castle ruins of Quebec.